All right, ladies and gentlemen, tonight we are going to play through Mortal Kombat Complete Mugen. This version is very, very close to uh, as good as the original arcade version, in my opinion. With the uh, extras included, like the run combo system, uh, it just works. It just works. So we're going to uh, quickly go through a Shang Tsung playthrough. We have set the difficulty up a bit so the uh, computer does a little more to us now. Um, Shang Tsung, though. Awesome, awesome character in this. Uh, Shang Tsung or Shang Fun, whatever you want to call him. He is definitely fun in this version. He has some great fatalities. Um, he's got some cool moves. He doesn't morph into the other character to use other than to do like a special move and it doesn't tell you how to do their moves so I kind of just uh, figured it out on my own. Not necessarily all of them, but uh, but most of them. Anyways, uh, you can see it's basically it's Shang Tsung from uh, Mortal Kombat 2 with the uh, Shang Tsung from Mortal Kombat 1 skin over top. So let's do his first fatality here. Fatality. You see, he turned into the uh, Mortal Kombat 3 Shang Tsung there. Shang Tsung. Or uh, Shang Tsung, however you want to say it. Or Shang Fun. He has one more uh, move here too, the sword, <laughs> which is kind of cool. Ooh, let's try to hit Johnny with Johnny. There you go. See, uh, let's see how many combos I drop in this uh, playthrough. <laughs> You'll notice the guards in the back moving a little bit. Another cool feature. Uh, Johnny Cage is awesome. Whatever the heck that is, it's not even the uh, it's not even the elbow, the flying elbow he has from Part Two. It's like a spin kick in the air. Really cool. What other fatalities does uh, Shang have in this? Incredible. Fatality. <laughs> I love it. I played through a Shang the other day and it was uh, it was so much fun. I wanted to come back and do it again. Uh, remain all the stages from the original remain in this. A little bit of uh, upgrading to them, I believe. A little more detail in the backgrounds. Very very cool though. And uh, you know what? Purists will say, now nah, we're not with the uh, the combo system like that. We don't like it. I'm telling you, it makes this game a ton of fun. <laughs> Seriously, if you get a chance to play it, Mortal Kombat Complete, it is incredible. Now, for uh, people wanting links to, uh, to these games, can't do it. Can't do it because uh, YouTube won't allow it. And I know other, uh, there's got to be others with the links in their uh, videos or whatever, but it uh, won't happen. Won't happen on my, uh, my channel. I can just tell you what the name of it is. And uh, just Google it. They're easy to get. Fatality. There you go, pit fatality, cool. You notice a bit of clarity on the uh, face of Scorpion in that, that tower. All right, a couple more fatalities. Let's see what else. Scorpion. All right, Shang Fun wins. Shang Foon wins. <laughs> Love the sound of the uh, skulls. So cool. Those screams uh, used to haunt my uh, nightmares when I was younger. 
What else do we have? We've got four fatalities in this. Fatality. Samurai Shang pulls out his sword, slices your head off. <clears throat> How cool is that? Now his uh, last fatality is uh, my favorite, one of my favorite fatalities of all of the Mugens that I've played. Um, it's just, it's so cool. Kano with uh, a ton of his uh, other moves. Oh. No wins. Right on. Jumping at him. Might not even win this one. We will not, but you know what? We'll continue anyways. Thing I, I gotta say, I don't like uh, Kano's winning pose in this. Um, it's his pose from. Yeah, the same. We got the uh, extra character here. But it's his pose, pose from Mortal Kombat 3. But they did something to his face. His face just looks different in this when he uh, when he does that. Hopefully we don't see it again because that would mean a loss. And while we were all anticipating the uh, fatality. This fatality that I absolutely love. Oh, we'll get it this time. Oh, that's dropped combo number 12. <laughs> Here we go. This cannonball goes all crazy. Oh, Fatality. Kung Lao. The Great Kung Lao. No, I didn't even know that was uh, that fatality was available in this uh, version. I thought it was only in the, uh, I believe it was Project Mugen. But I think it's so cool that they included it in this one. So let's see what his friendship is. That's actually one I haven't seen yet. I'm curious to see what they would do in, uh, oh, this Mugen version. And, uh, Liu Kang. <laughs> Sound effects for Liu Kang in this one. Awesome. It's the uh, MK4 sound effects, I think, for Liu Kang. Ah, oh, there you go. Friendship. Friendship. So it's his uh, Mortal Kombat 2 friendship. Very, very cool. All right, how are we going to uh, punish Sub-Zero? I have it. I have an idea. Excellent. <laughs> Not awesome. Holy crap. Oh. Ooh, nice. Oh, jeez. Tried to fight fire with uh, ice. Didn't work. All right, enough, uh, enough of this uh, dropping combo crap. There we go. Brutality. 
It almost looked like he uh, wasn't even touching him there. All right, the elusive reptile. Ooh, he got scared of my ice, iciness. <laughs> there you go, reptile. I believe it is uh, Ed Boon on the uh, in the middle there, in the middle pole, and I believe that is uh, John Tobias right there, and I believe the uh, woman in the back is, I'm not sure, and uh, that one head is Jerry Seinfeld. Oh, you... Reptile. Crazy. All serious, uh, seriousness, though, it's really cool that you're fighting him at the bottom of the uh, pit. Just like you would in uh, the arcade version. However, he's not a secret character in this. He's just a uh, regular character that you can use. We got a guy in the back there. Looks like he's a Burger King employee. <laughs> Could be wrong. I don't know. All right, let's do our favorite. Fatality. My favorite fatality. Again. Well, that sucked. <laughs> That's not what I wanted to do. So Reptile lives. He lives to see another Mortal Kombat. The infamous Ermac. Error Macro, I should say. Can you tell what I'm doing right now? I'm invisible uh, reptile. All right. Oh, nice. Tricky, tricky. Oh, he interrupted my skull, so it only uh, shot two. That's cool. And again, if uh, you haven't seen this version yet, uh, instead of calling him Ermac, they use his real name, which uh, is Error Macro. Which is uh, Error Macaroni and Cheese. Error Macaroni and Cheese. Nice. I love the uh, the background for this stage. Uh, the stage in general, but if you look, you can actually see like mountains in the background and such. I don't know if anybody paid attention to that uh, in the past. But I've been noticing because I've been playing the heck out of these games lately. I've been noticing uh, cool things in the background that I've never noticed before. Apparently. So, all right, we lost to Ermac. Will we lose again? Shang no. Alright. Cool outfit. And just like uh, all the other ones, you choose a different button to select your character. They have a different color palettes. Crush me with Era Ermac. Almost as if I'm playing Char Lizard or something. <laughs> Get him. Alright, let's do one more fantastic fatality. So cool. Fatality. Alright, here we go. Boss time. Bosses aren't too hard in this version. Thank goodness. Uh, I don't want to speak too soon just because I do lose, but uh, Goro is definitely a lot easier than uh, Goro in Mortal Kombat 1 when I play on the arcade. <laughs> yeah, we're not dropping combos now, are we? Shang Fung wins. Those 
strangely enough, or not strangely, whatever whatever the case is, yeah, you always fight Goro on his stage. Whereas uh, the other characters in the game, as uh, we well know, the uh, rotation of the stages is, is crazy. All right, here we go. Shang Fun. <laughs> Can't fool me with that one. Oh, shit, it's mine. Ooh. Crap. <laughs> there we go, finally. Ah. Ooh, he does, uh, Scorpion does have a scissor sweep in this. All right. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I am uh, splicing this in as my camera died for some reason. So as you can see, I won a... Uh, I did win a round, okay? We're in the uh, same match where my camera puked out. But uh, yes, I did win another round. And we are starting round three right now. Here we go. <laughs> Unbelievable. You can still see the win counter is the same. Hopefully I can win this. There we go. Technical difficulties. Thank goodness for uh, splicing. And there you have it. <laughs> uh, the round that I... Well, no, okay, yeah, you saw the round that I lost. And then, uh, you know, I won the other round and fantastic fashion and then won this one all right so there you have it unfortunately there's no ending for um shang sung in this uh they didn't uh, they didn't create one uh for every other character there's an ending except for uh, actually i don't think ermac has one either or ermac wrote but uh, anyways ladies and gentlemen there you have it uh one of the greatest or the greatest uh version of mortal kombat one uh, for a Mugen. I love it. I love that you can get rid of the uh, run running combos or you can uh, add them. I love that uh, every character has a, another fatality um, that they're kind of uh, redrawn as well and uh, the addition of Shang Tsung. His, his moves are really cool. His fatality is, is awesome where he uh, summons the uh, ancient Kung Lao. Very cool. All right. Thank you very much for watching, and I uh, hope you enjoy the rest of your day.